pretty much complete. One side of the stage is filled with two grand pianos and the end of the woodwind. And the cellos are spread rather luxuriously on the other side of the podium. The first of the three of the symphony of psalms sets these words from Psalm 39. Hear my prayer, O Lord, and give ear unto my cry. Hold not thy peace at my tears. After an instrumental fugue, the words of the second movement are, I waited patiently for the Lord, and he inclined unto me and heard my cry. And finally, from Psalm 150 comes, Let everything that hath breath praise the Lord. There's a very Slavonic fervor to the music for the last movement, whether it's in Latin or not. And be the music slow and mystic, or fast and excited, and it's both. It's a wonderful, timeless climax, if you like, to the work. Gives you symphony chorus arranged behind the orchestra. And here once again comes Dima Slobodinuk to conduct the BBC Symphony Chorus the orchestra in Stravinsky's Symphony of Psalms. who comes into our borders on the basis of the value you bring. Well, everybody brings a value. You can decide, you know, which areas you want people to go into, how to manage the migration strategy. But I don't think we have a strategy saying we're going to stop the boats because we know we 